Hey everybody, Bob Marson coming to you from Eastlake on the east side of Birmingham, Alabama for another episode of A Song for Sunday. Well, this week I picked a special song. Um, I guess they're all pretty special. Um, this one, I don't know, it just seems extra special. Uh, it's one that I first learned uh, when I was at a, um, at a music and uh, arts uh, workshop uh, and camp. That's, uh, it's called the Alabama Folk School and it happens... Uh, uh, several times throughout the year and there's there are camps that focus on different um uh different folk arts and uh um and folk traditions uh this one in particular is the uh bluegrass and uh, the g's bend uh, quilter uh camp that happens uh, usually in april this year it's going to be uh i believe uh, april 20th 21st and 22nd uh, if i'm not mistaken on that and the very first time i went was in 2019 it was, uh, I think, the first weekend in April, something like that, and uh, uh, same same thing, bluegrass and G's Bend quilters, um, and so I was there to, you know, work on my harmony singing that time, and this upcoming time, I'm going to be working with Kenny Smith uh, doing a, the bluegrass guitar two course. Um, anyway, so I signed up for the folk school recently, and uh, it reminded me of, of my experiences there, and I think it's just a perfectly fitting song, so the... Uh, the song is one that's, um, uh, uh, as far as I know, it's traditional. Uh, check me out on that. I, I researched to see if I could find another version that's like this. And there, there are other songs with this title and that contain this uh, lyrical theme, but none that, that are even really similar to uh, the words or the melody arrangement that, uh, that the, the ladies of, uh, of G's Bend, the, those quilters that they, that they sing. Uh, and one morning I was there at the folk school uh, having breakfast in the in the uh, cafeteria hall there. Um, and uh, every morning, you know, some, uh, someone would present something. One of the, the, uh, the instructors or something would, would do a, a little musical showcase uh, to get us started in the morning. And one morning, uh, the Quilters of G's Bend sang this song, and I don't know that there was a dry eye or an unmoved spirit in the entire place. It was one of the most amazing things I've ever heard. Uh, their version is completely a cappella. And uh, I'm going to link to it uh, as well as to their websites and stuff in the uh, in the description or in the comments, depending on, on what platform you're looking this on. So uh, please go check them out. It's a um, completely unique quilting tradition to uh, that area, uh, G's Bend, the G's Bend area of Alabama near Boykin, Alabama. Uh, so uh, it's it's a really special thing this uh, this tradition that that, that community has. Uh, in quilting and it's it's got uh, you know spirituality and prayer all mixed in through it so uh, you know go ahead and check them out it's a really special group of people and special work that they do special uh, area of the world and of our state here in Alabama um, and I took the liberty of, of writing a little guitar arrangement for it to accompany myself because the way they do it is it's completely a cappella. so some of the women are singing kind of like the accompaniment the harmony and the and the the what instruments would be playing if there were instruments and then there's a, a lead singer that, that is that's you know leading the singing and and is uh kind of more the the singer that you would expect if there were instruments anyway so i uh, hope i hope i do it justice with my arrangement and i hope you'll enjoy this song one last little thing to me some of what's in this song is also in the music that we were talking about last week in that reggae music and that bob marley and jimmy cliff and toots and the maytals and all that great jamaican music and that is you know I'm going to be positive. I'm going to believe in, in hope and love and, and the power of those of those uh, forces in the world. But I'm also going to, you know, call out either oppression or injustice or whatever it might be. Uh, and so the whole idea of, of, uh, of you know, that, that we should only suffer here uh, on earth and be given some sort of heavenly reward later, uh, you know, sometimes that's, that's not acceptable because uh, we deserve to have... Uh, you know, fair treatment and an opportunity uh, to be, you know, just a regular old human being um, and whatever kind of special person we are uh, in the here and now. So anyway, uh, this is Give Me My Flowers Whilst I Yet Live. I don't want nobody to praise me when I'm gone. I don't want nobody to praise me when I'm gone. I don't want nobody to praise me when I'm gone. Give me my flowers while 
whilst I yet live, whilst I yet live, the flowers that you give me, I can't see their beauty. Flowers that you give me, I can't see their beauty. The flowers that you give me, I can't see their beauty. Whilst I yet live, whilst I yet live, flowers that you give me, I can't tell nobody. Flowers that you give me, I can't tell nobody. Flowers that you give me, I can't tell nobody. Whilst I yet live, whilst I yet live, I don't want nobody to praise me when I'm gone. I don't want nobody to praise me when I'm gone. I don't want nobody to praise me when I'm gone. Whilst I yet live, whilst I yet live, give me my flowers whilst I yet live, whilst I yet live. Well, let me know what you think of my admittedly, uh, uh, you know, not quite as awesome version as the what the ladies do. And like I said, there's going to be a link in the description. Check out their version. It, it's one of the most beautiful things I've ever heard. And I listen to it uh, all the time. And I love, I love listening to it. So, uh, and check them out, you know, get an, op you know, take an opportunity to support them. Uh, you know, check out the quilts, go visit if you're passing through. Uh, and, you know, while you're at it, also check out the Alabama Folk School. There's all sorts of things, music, crafts, uh, blacksmithing, all kinds of different things that, that go on up there. And, uh, check that out and see if that's something you want to do, um. And in the meantime, uh, check out all the places that I'm on social media. This has kind of been about other stuff rather than about me. But of course, you know, I'm always needing some support too. So, you know, hit the like button, subscribe, hit the notification bell. Check out bobmarson.com for upcoming shows. March 11th, Iron City with Rough Grass. Uh, and then the second half of the month, we'll be doing uh, some touring uh, around the Southeast. Anyway, uh, hope you all are doing well. Take care of yourselves. Take care of the people around you. And I'll see you next week. Bye.